What is going on, everyone? Welcome back. Here we are with episode 76 of Hashtag Nisto Drinks. And this week's episode is going to be a review on the Starbucks Pistachio Latte. <music> Happy Hashtag Thirsty Thursday. Welcome back, Beverage Barrage. I am so excited for this week's episode. I'm happy you're here because this is a very exciting drink. I saw it, a Twitter ad for it uh, a few days ago, and I said, I got to do that for Hashtag Thirsty Thursday. I got to get on this. So very exciting. I'm a big fan of pistachios. Way back when, if you can even believe it, episode two of the Hashtag Nisto Bros podcast, we did our first ever Mount Rushmore. It's only on our YouTube channel. Go check it out if you haven't. Mike and I both put the pistachio, spoiler alert, on our Mount Rushmores of nuts. I'm very excited to try this. It seems like a combination that should have been thought of before and sounds really good. Pistachio latte sounds like, I mean, I just got a whiff. It smells good, sounds good. Uh, I'm very excited to see if it tastes good. I hope it tastes good because before I take a, a sip, this drink from Starbucks, this is a tall, by the way, their smallest size, and I spent $5.05 on it. Over an Abe Lincoln, more than an Abe Lincoln, on this little cup of coffee. So let me just say for Starbucks sakes, I hope this tastes good. That's all I'm going to say. And it doesn't, you know, dampen my excitement. It's just something I needed to mention. We know Starbucks is pricey, but come on, a tall five dollars here we go pistachio latte from starbucks very excited here we go so i did a little bit of research before i you know started the episode i wanted to know like what exactly was in it that was making it pistachio e so they have their own pistachio syrup which i definitely get the the nuttiness of the pistachio definitely comes out it's not a it's very like kind of like a vague nuttiness it's not uh, specific pistachio taste is what uh, I would say. But the other thing that I thought was kind of intriguing, but also a little weird that they um, that they have, hold on, let me crack the lid and see if we can see it, is a, br it's not brown at all. There it is. It says that there is a brown butter, <laughs> salted brown butter topping. And I kind of got that. There was like a little bit of, you know, a saltiness to it too. But I really think the two biggest flavors I got were the nuttiness from the pistachio and then the coffee flavor, obviously, as well. So I'm going to take another sip and see how it goes. Yeah, there's not much of that, like, that saltiness or butteriness that um, the topping provides. Um, maybe it's just, maybe it's because I'm drinking it through the lid and it's not really uh, coming through or something like that. But um, the nutty flavor is really nice. It's a very nice compliment to coffee. I don't think that it's like super on point with um, like the pistachio flavor. I think it, it is more of just like a gel, like it's kind of almond-ish, you know, it's just kind of more of a general nuttiness that isn't necessarily like pistachios. So I'm going to take another sip here and then maybe give it a grade. Yeah, it's just kind of it's kind of falling flat in like the wow factor, you know? It's just kind of like if you get, you know, an almond milk latte, let's just say, and you're getting a good amount of almond milk in there that mixes with the coffee and you kind of get a nutty uh, taste with your coffee taste. And I'm a big fan of that, like the mixing of, of nut and coffee. I think that's a good combination, which is why I was pretty excited for this. But I don't think that they really hit it out of the park on the the pistachio front. I think it is just a little bit more, I guess, bitter because I feel like pistachio is a little bit saltier of a nut um, if I had to describe it in, in in any way. And I think maybe they try to do the salted brown butter to help out with that, but I'm not really getting that either. So it's, it's, it's good, but it's not really, it's good is what I'll say. Like it's not fantastic either and it's not really hitting the mark. So I'm definitely gonna have to take some points off for that, but I think I'm gonna take one more sip. The other thing I wanted to say was that there's an, also an iced option that also has the salted brown butter topping, but I decided to go with the hot. Again, still, you know, it was like 30 something degrees today. I uh, wanted a warm beverage, and I also thought that it would be better for the, the topping because 
if I was drinking like an iced, you know, coffee and I was doing, I would get none of the topping at all. So I'm going to take one more sip, but I think I'm good on a grade here. I'm doing it without the top, by the way, so I can get maybe some of the topping. Okay. I mean, I got a little bit more of the topping that time. The topping didn't really do too much for me. It kind of just, it was the topping and I got that first. I got that little bit of salty creaminess and then the coffee kind of just washed it down with, you know, again, like a little hint of nut that time. Not as much as the other uh, sips, I will say. So there it is. Pistachio latte. I'm going to say not worth the Lincoln, yeah, especially if you're going to get uh, bigger than a, a tall and if you're going to get the iced one, I'm, I'm sure, I'm pretty sure they charge more for iced lattes. I think, it, I think it's kind of hard to justify. Maybe just, uh, if you really want to try it, go for it. But I'm only going to give this a 5.5. Uh, not really, not really digging it too much. So that's what I'm going to give it. Here's the shirt that I'm wearing. It says peace, love, sip on it. Hashtag Nisso drinks. Go check out our merch store if you haven't. There's a link in the description of this video or in our Instagram bio. Check out hashtag Nisto Eats tomorrow on another hashtag Foodie Friday. The podcast will be posted on Saturday. As always, don't forget to use the code Nisto Bros on the Cheesley's app for $5 off any order, $25 or more. If you enjoy this video, please leave a like and follow on Instagram subscribe on YouTube, share it out to all your friends so they can join the beverage barrage, join the foodies and don't miss out on anything. So that's all from me. Peace, love, sip.